I don't know an hour before you get in. Do you sleep in pyjamas? No. Right. Would that, sometimes it can be cooler because you, um, your skin sweats if it's not got something to absorb the sweat, like, a, I don't know, just a t-shirt and a pair of boxer shorts or something like that. I don't really think about I don't, I just, I don't, I, 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 I'm sorry, uh. Well, you're coming up with some great ideas here. Do you have any, um, I'm just thinking about things with caffeine in it, like fizzy drinks, close to bedtime, because that can make you perspire at night. No, I, I try not to, but I, I, I don't sleep very well anyway, so I just, I just have to do, I, I don't sleep very well because of the weather, and I don't sleep very well because I'm, and I'm sleeping because I'm in pain, so it's just... So it's just a big, well, linked, isn't it? Yeah. Do you like going out for meals with other people or just go out on your own? Uh, I just go out by myself. So I only go out to I only go to the shop and back and come back. Right. So is it just to eat? It's not the social side of. No, I only go out to eat. Yeah, yeah, I only go out to eat. Do you do right now? This is helpful for heat. Um, I don't know. I just, I just sleep a lot. Do you, um, have you tried peppermint tea? Because you can make lollies out of them and that's, peppermint's good for settling your stomach, but the lolly would make it nice and cool. I take peppermint capsules. Right. Have you tried peppermint tea then? No. Is it something you might like to give a go with lollipops out of? Uh, sure. That's something they do recommend if you've had some sort of, you know, keyhole stirred surgery or something and you've had to put some gas in your tummy so it's to get rid of all that excess gas. It gets it naturally back into the bloodstream rather than it rumbling, which can make you feel bloated and as you say, I'm worried that you're going to explode. I mean, what you can do is just give them a try. If it doesn't work, then we'll yeah, some other things. We've got lots here for, yeah. for, for food, especially Chris, about do's for, for food. Because I think what's really important about the heat and the food is that the food it's coming inside and it's going to your tummy, isn't it? So that's the frozen stuff going to your tummy is definitely going to help that. And if you can eat regularly so you're not over hungry, then that's going to keep your blood pressure down, which is going to keep your heat down as well. Are you in your glasses when you go out, Chris? Yeah. Yeah. I might put heat oh. slash weather just because that is these sunglasses though. sunglasses right. yeah yeah because it's the brightness as well that's mm. that's tricky isn't it you don't like people touching your hair do you mind wearing a cap or anything like that to keep the sun that's no uh, I won't I wear a hat I just don't like because it's just different people touching me right so something to keep the sun off you because if the sun's on your face you tend to I don't mean you, you. We tend to respond by screwing our face up and that can make us feel a bit tense and hot as well. So your granddad's coat's really important to you. So you, you wear that every time you go out. Yeah. You have worn your thinner one, haven't you, sometimes? 
Yeah. yeah. What's what's different about those days where you decide to wear the thing on? I'm usually washing my other coat. Ah, so it's when the it's when the other coat's not available. Okay. Would you feel close to granddad if you took a picture of it and took the picture out? No, I just wear it because I'm just used to it. I think it's not the case, but it's just, I'm just so used to wearing that coat. Because it looks a good thick one. Mm. Yeah, it's good for winter. And it's quite long, Definitely isn't it? Definitely good for winter. Yeah. It's a good coat for winter. But what we're talking about here is we're talking about doing something different to make things better. And that might be definitely one of those big things that is fantastic over winter, but it's not a good one for summer. Yeah. Do they sell those... Um, Water bottles, which think it'd be a seaside town that have the fang on them that spray the water. I know it's fine now. Maybe. Would you, how do you feel about water, Chris? Oh, it's kind of going. It looks like it. It's just the wind. Oh. <laughs> that door doesn't click. To be fair, it might be a little easier, small, slightly falling. Yeah, maybe I'll check the bottom of the door. <laughs> How would you feel about water spraying, Chris? I don't really like water the best time. No, no. Right. Okay, so shower. Are you sh are you showering? Yeah, I got a shower yesterday, last night before today. Last night. How how hot do you have your shower? Lukewarm. Really really a colder shower can help you really. Cool. I know. I don't like things touching me. Yeah, I understand. I'm not just, yeah, not, again, I don't, I'm not trying too difficult for the sake no, of just being like. this is why we're making a Chris list yeah. and not just for anyone. This is things that are going to be yeah. helpful with just you. Do you just, after a 